Hi there guys, I'm Nikhil from Greedy Tech and in this video I'll be doing the gaming review, battery drain test and the heat test of the Redmi 7A. Now coming to my current setup, there are two huge lights on either side, there is no AC running in the background and the current room temperature is around 26 to 27 degrees. Now let's check the temperature of the phone. On the front it's 34 degrees, at the bottom it is 35. On the back I've seen a maximum of 35 degrees and at the bottom it is 35 degrees. Currently phone has 53% of battery left. Now we'll start the timer and start the gaming review with Asphalt 9. So guys, as you can see, visuals are neither bad nor great. They are good, there is a slight bit of lag, but the game is still playable. So guys, I played this game for about 12 minutes. Now let's check the temperature. On the front, it's 38 degrees. At the bottom, it's about 39 to 40 degrees. On the back, once again, it's about 39 to 40 degrees. And at the bottom, it is 37 to 38 degrees. Next, I'll be playing PUBG Lite. So guys, as you can see, visuals are looking pretty good. You can't see any details properly due to the display and the resolution and the low graphic settings on the game. But on the positive side, I couldn't notice any lag. So guys, I've been playing this game for about 15 minutes. Now let's check the temperature. On the front, I've seen maximum 40 degrees. At the bottom, it is 40 once again. On the back, I've seen a maximum of 41. At the bottom, it is 38 degrees. Even now, phone feels slightly warm. It's still manageable. You can still continue playing the game. Now I'll be playing the actual PUBG mobile game. Now there are no HD graphic settings on this phone. So first, I'll be playing it at balanced graphic settings with medium frame rate. So guys, as you can see, there is minimal to no lag, gameplay is pretty smooth, visuals are good, obviously not great. Now I'll be switching to the smooth graphic settings with medium frame rate. So 
So guys, I've been playing this game for about 13 minutes. Now let's check the temperature. On the front, I've seen a maximum of 39 to 40 degrees. At the bottom, it is 40 degrees once again. On the back, I've seen a maximum of 41 degrees. And at the bottom, it is 38 degrees. Even now, phone doesn't feel hot at all. It's just slightly warm. So guys, it's been about 40 minutes since I've been playing these games. And the battery percentage is currently 45%. So for approximately 40 minutes of gameplay, phone used about 8% of battery which is definitely a great thing. Most phones use about 8-10% to of battery for just 30 minutes of gameplay, but this phone is doing a pretty good job. Now for the final heat test, I'll be taking pictures using both the front and rear cameras continuously for 3 minutes and then check the temperature. Now I'll reset the timer and start taking pictures. So guys, it's been 3 minutes, now let's check the temperature. On the front, I've seen a maximum of 41 to 42 degrees. At the bottom, it is 41 degrees. On the back, I've seen a maximum of 42 degrees. And at the bottom, it is 39 degrees. Even now, phone is not hot. It's just slightly warm. Now, I'll be using this phone for a minute to see if there is any throttling going on. By the way, guys, in those 3 minutes, I've taken about 113 images, which is not that great. Right after the heat test, when I tried to use the phone, there was a bit of lag and few applications are crashing and they are not even opening. So there seemed to be some kind of throttling issue going on. So guys, on the whole, there are no heating issues with this phone, but don't push it to its limits. If you notice that your phone is not responding well, it became hot, just put it aside for a few minutes, let it cool down, then everything should work normally. So guys, that was the gaming review, battery drain test and the heat test of the Redmi 7A. If you're planning to buy this phone, use the link in the description, it always helps the channel. And if you want us to make any specific video, Tweet out to us with the hashtag AskGreedyTech on Twitter and we will try to make it as soon as possible. I'm Nikhil from Greedy Tech signing off. Have a nice day.